Focus is available for kindergarten through eighth grade students. It has varying copyright dates, but most are 2009, 2012, and 2014, and the edition is known as the 2015 edition. Math and Focus was developed by Great Source, a division of Houghton Mifflin Harcourt, in conjunction with Marshall Cavendish. The basic instructional sequences are similar to other Singapore approach math courses. In fact, the content is very close to the standards edition, although material added to the 2015 edition aligns it with Common Core standards. Math and Focus has the most American classroom style, look, and feel. The teacher edition is very comprehensive, thorough, and extensive, but also fairly user-friendly at the daily lesson level. There is excellent instruction and helpful illustrations in presenting the Singapore Approach math concepts, some of which may be new to us as parent teachers. Student texts are full-sized, meaning they are 8.5 by 11, as well as full color and hardback. These texts are also rich in illustrations and instruction. They contain about double the number of pages of their primary math counterparts, with more instructional material and illustrations. The student workbooks, although black and white paperbacks, are also full size. Pages are perforated. Math and Focus is strong on review. Workbooks contain cumulative reviews after every two chapters, and each workbook also contains a cumulative review at the end of the book. Differing a bit in its organizational structure, Math and Focus teacher editions are oversized, spiral-bound books that provide a wealth of information, some more necessary for classroom situations than for homeschools. However, the carefully laid out lesson plans and the availability of useful information where you need it makes them a good homeschool fit as well. Chapters form a cohesive progression of skills instruction. Each chapter begins with a review of previously learned material and contains a distinct chapter review along with test preparation worksheets at the end of each chapter. The tests, however, are only available in the assessments book. An extensive chapter planning guide includes three one-page sections that include an overview, differentiation resources, and assessment and remediation options. Then follows two-page spreads that outline each instructional section. These include pacing, objectives, vocabulary, resources needed, in other words, student books and materials, manipulatives, and standards. For instance, Chapter 6 covers the multiplication tables of 6, 7, 8, and 9. Each of these are covered in their own lesson, with some lessons taking two or three days. Division as a concept is introduced as the last lesson of this chapter. So let's look specifically at that lesson. Lesson plan pages are a wraparound format with reduced copies of student books. Teacher instructions peer directly below the corresponding student text pages. A sidebar column at the beginning of each lesson repeats the information from the chapter outline. Plus, there is a five-minute warm-up. The teacher edition helps parents and teachers understand the approach and the course material and suggests ways for you to introduce concepts. Much of the concrete aspect of the lesson presentation is conducted by the teacher using manipulatives and supplies outlined in the teacher edition. All this before progressing to the pictorial representation found in the textbooks. The detailed daily lessons include concept information, directions for teacher-led and or student activities, and a fairly scripted discussion labeled Learn that provides the main instructional component for the lesson. This segment provides the concrete aspect for the lesson instructing the parent or teacher to use connecting cubes or counters to demonstrate dividing into groups. Additionally, the teacher editions provide a wealth of information for special learning situations such as struggling learners or English language learners. Reproducible black line masters for activities outlined in the daily lessons are found in the back of the teacher edition. Although the student books are written directly to the student, the instruction is always coming from and or is supervised by the teacher. This is really noticeable in Math and Focus by the interaction between the student book and the teacher edition. Any answers needed for the discussion are provided right in the teacher edition. There is the same degree of interaction between the workbooks and the teacher editions with detailed instructions for the workbook pages in a section called Let's Practice. Students complete the workbook pages independently. All assignments for the workbook pages are listed in the teacher editions within the lesson plans. Reduced copy of the student workbook pages are also included along with answers filled in. 
There are specific page references in the lesson plan for incorporating some of the Math and Focus supplemental material, such as the reteach books for struggling learners or the extra practice books. It's easy to see the concrete to pictorial to abstract progression in this lesson. In the instructional segment, the teacher sets up the Connecting Cubes presentation and provides the concrete. The student book provides the pictorial with their visual groupings of items. Then the student book moves to the abstract when it shows the written form of the division problem. When the student completes the workbook assignments, they are operating in the realm of the abstract. However, it's interesting to note that even the wording of the problems, finding equal groups, brings up a mental image of the pictorial stage. Homeschool packages for grades K through 5 include the student book, workbook, and teacher's edition for one semester of a grade level, either A or B. Full year packages are also available with a parent answer key instead of the teacher's edition. These parent answer keys contain reduced student pages with the answers filled in, just like the reduced pages in the teacher edition. These include the full grade levels in one book. Student book A and B pages are in the front, workbook A and B pages are in the back. Packages with the answer key include the student book A and B, workbook A and B, and the parent answer key. Student packs include only the student textbooks and workbooks for both semesters, plus the assessments book. There are also manipulatives packages for each grade level that provide most of the manipulatives needed for each grade level. Supplements for grades 1 through 5 include the enrichment, extra practice, and reteach workbooks, as well as an assessments book. The assessment book provides a pretest and a test prep type of test for each chapter. These tests have both multiple choice questions and free response questions. There are also periodic cumulative assessments called benchmark tests after the first and third quarter, along with a mid-year test which cover topics from earlier units. Finally, in this book, there is a single, extensive, year-end assessment which covers the complete course. None of the tests in this book are reproducible, but a complete answer key is included. The Supplemental Extra Practice series matches the scope and sequence of the textbooks, and the consumable A and B workbooks are similar in format to the workbooks, providing most of the same types of problems and exercises. Answers are included. The reteach workbooks correspond to the chapters in each level of the student book and workbook and provide examples with guided instruction along with additional practice problems. Reteach books serve the needs of some students who just need additional instruction and work on most concepts in order to achieve mastery. Answers and solutions are found in the back of each book. Enrichment books correspond to the semester to the courses and provide challenging additional work. Shifting gears to the beginning level of the educational spectrum, we see that the Math and Focus Kindergarten program is different in both format and presentation from the rest of the elementary program. Each semester has a teacher edition and two full-color student work texts instead of the text and workbook format of the older grades. All instruction is in the wraparound teacher edition with activities that investigate, that discover, that explore, and that apply. Lessons are detailed with introductory sidebars at the beginning of each lesson that list objectives, materials needed, and what student pages will be covered. A two-page chart at the beginning of each chapter outlines the lessons. There are references in the teacher edition to a big book. These are large books with children's stories designed for classroom use. We don't carry these due to their expense, but you can get by without them. There are four student books in the course, two for each semester. These books are full color and engaging. They include number writing practice as well as math skills. By the end of the series, the student is writing arithmetic sentences. The assessment book for the kindergarten course is black and white. The kindergarten homeschool packages for each semester include the two student work texts and the corresponding teacher edition. There is also a student pack that includes all four of the student work texts. In the middle grades, Math and Focus again changes a bit in terms of format. The Math and Focus middle school courses 1, 2, and 3 correspond to grades 6 through 8. These use the same conceptually rich approach and format as the elementary series, but focus on ratio, geometry, number, statistics, and expressions. 
Chapter coverage of a particular skill set always starts with review, followed by lessons covering specific topics and concluding with a chapter wrap-up and review. The Wraparound Teacher Edition provides instructional guidance through the topic as well as guide practice through a number of example problems. The hardcover, non-consumable student text provides easy-to-follow instructional text. Students are assigned practice exercises to be worked independently. Answers for all the guided practice problems and the odd-numbered problems in the practice sets are in the back of the student book. Also in the back of the book is a four-page glossary, a five-page table of measures, formulas, and symbols, and an index. The chapter wrap-ups, available at the end of each chapter, are rather unique and interesting concept maps, which provide a visual summary of how the chapter's topic has been covered. Each homeschool kit includes the hardcover teacher edition and the hardcover student edition for one semester. There are several supplemental books that are optional for the middle grade courses. These include extra practice, black line activities, enrichment, and assessments, each of which cover both semesters. Extra practice books are designed for on-level students and provide similar exercises to those found in the text lessons. Brain at Work problems go one step further in terms of challenge. Answers are in the back of the book. Students who are ready for additional challenge will find it in the enrichment books. Like before, the Brain at Work problems go an additional next step. Answers are in the back of this book as well. The assessment book offers a pretest and two forms of the chapter test for each chapter of the student books. There are also cumulative benchmark tests at the end of each chapter, as well as a mid-course test and the end-of-course test. Test pages are perforated and answers are in the back of the book. Blackline activities books, which are only available for courses 1, 2, and 3, provide reproducible activity worksheets for the hands-on activities, typically designed for partner or team cooperative work. There are activities for each chapter of the student text. Solutions are provided in the back of the book. Students completing the Middle Grades Math and Focus Courses series will be well prepared for any algebra course. If you have any questions about any of the Math and Focus courses or would like to talk to someone about Singapore math in general, please contact our Rainbow Consultants. We can be reached during our regular office hours, Monday through Friday, 8.30 a.m. to 5 o'clock p.m. Central Time. Our phone number is 888-841-3456 and our email is consultants at rainbowresource.com. You can also contact us through the live chat feature on the website.